Good morning, everybody. Good morning, YouTubers. Good morning, Rebel Watchers. <laughs> yeah, okay, so I am on my way to um, the Bluegrass Festival. It is crappy out. <laughs> yeah, I still have my little curler in my hair. It is crappy out. Um, rainy, gloomy, cold. My, well, cold, but my clock says um, 55 degrees. It says 55 degrees. But we're cold. Um, woke up this morning with a headache. So I knew it, you know, from this barometer weather, I guess, I don't know if that's the right term for it, but anyway. Um, yeah, I woke up with a little headache from all the rain that gives me a headache sometime, rain, possible rain. But anyway, so um, I have a, a mouth guard on because I broke my tooth. I thought it was a crown, but it's actually my real tooth. So um, I couldn't remember if it's the other one up on top that has a crown on it. These dentists do such a good job. <laughs> but anyway, um, so I tried putting the wax on it. I may have told you this already. I tried putting that wax on there that the kids use for their braces, but it's just not doing the job. It's cutting my mouth up. So um, it doesn't hurt. So maybe, you know, I think just, uh, you know, I think that's like my six-year-old molar that came in, my permanent tooth. So who knows? I mean, you know, we're talking about a tooth that's pretty old. <laughs> if I got it when I was like six, it was my, you know, permanent tooth. I got it like when I was six. So talking about a tooth that's like, you know, 60 years old. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm not quite 66, but I'm 65. So anyway, I'm... um headed over to this place called Craig's RV Park and I'm going to get myself set up. It's first come first serve $10 a night to listen to some bluegrass. If I want to actually go into the pavilion with the bluegrass, you pay I think it's $7 a person if you go, but you can hear it really good from your um, from your camper. And I'm going to be meeting up with Motorhome Max and um maybe full tiny house is supposed to be coming and meeting up with us too so it should be some fun for two days i'll take you with whatever i can let's go no you've been a good friend and that's in the thick and thin and i know it's never gonna end because you've been a good friend Okay, Craig's RV is only, it's 14 minutes from this Walmart, but, um, it's really only like a couple miles, but it's because of the way, I guess this place is, so. And here's the address for Craig's RV Park and Resort in Arcadia. Arcadia is kind of cowboy country. I call it cowboy country, cowgirl country. It's of many, many farms and ranches and uh, growers in Arcadia, but a lot of cattle, a lot of cattle ranchers here in Arcadia, Florida. You'll see here, after I go through this light, there's a ranch on each side of the road. And there's some like white cows out over here. Some horses and cattle on the other side.
bluegrass. sure where to go but I'm gonna go in and see and we'll see where I gotta go park I'll be back oh look who's here it's the full tiny house family yep the kids are here Dana's here everybody's getting settled in it's pretty cold looking out the window here and there's a couple more of my friends in that unity with the two chairs out there the little mat they're here with their grandchild and it's pretty cold out so people are staying inside there's the pavilion where the event will take place tomorrow night but there'll be some individual jamming tonight around different camps it's gonna be fun people are pulling up they have a little eating concession that you can buy food at if you didn't bring your own, because some people aren't camping. Some people are just driving in in a car. And there you have it. Me, I'm hitting the showers, because the showers are right over here in the same building, but you can see all the people here. This whole field is filled with campers. And there's shooting star way over there yonder in the distance. And full tiny houses under the tree. You can't see oh, let's see if you can see it. There they are. Full tiny houses there. And there's all that land yet still. So there'll be people still coming today to listen to the music tonight. Anybody that's into bluegrass. Pretty cool. Okay, this is the shower. This is the shower. It is a separate handicapped bathroom, and then in the back there is a shower. Everybody, RV Rebel Girl and welcome to my channel. I am here in Arcadia, Florida at the Bluegrass Festival here that they have once a month and they allow you to camp on their property. You can boondock more or less for 10 bucks or you can get a full hookup. I'm gonna go check out some of this music playing over here in the pavilion behind me. All the banjo players and guitar players and fiddle players. taking you with me and we may even meet up with full tiny Good, huh?
Debbie's van, Debbie and Mike's van, because she wants to go play with Debbie and Mike. 
You can't go over there. They're busy. The baby's sleeping. She wants to go over there and play with the baby. Well, he's three. Gospel banjo music coming up here. Sunday. cute little park they actually have a spot which I think is the coolest thing where they have you can have well, let me see if I can get this out and show it to you right there it's a it's a yard with clotheslines oh my gosh isn't that what a great idea so it's right by the laundry room and if you want to hang your clothes out to dry, you can on the clotheslines. Unbelievable. It's right by the laundry room, right by the shuffleboard. <laughs> that is so cool. I've never seen that anywhere. It's like hanging your clothes in your backyard. <laughs> Pretty neat. Have a great day.